we got to move our trap down because it's too far up. Of course, the water has went down quite a bit. So we'll try to remedy that. <coughs> Oh great, my work phone's ringing. It's calling my wife. Now she'll call back and I'll take my glove off. Yeah, I didn't need nothing. I pocket dialed you trying to set this trap. Alright, love you. Bye. <coughs> about how to rebate, when to rebate, but we will rebate, just to be safe. Thing about this mud it seems to be really sandy. Dry fat brushes off. Alright, Friday, February 21st. Checking our beaver set down here. See what we get.
negative. Yep, everything's still there. So, there. guess we'll. Saturday the 22nd um, we're doing we caught that beaver so now we're gonna we're gonna do a, a, a clean and cook um, we've done the catch clean cook so I've already cleaned it I got it cleaned up I got it in the crock pot come over here and you can look that's what it looks like I put a little uh, some of this this is Hickman's ribeye seasoning a little onion powder some garlic powder and just a little bit of uh, fresh uh, ground black pepper so we're gonna put this in a crock pot all this all afternoon um, probably bone it out and uh, pull it and we're just gonna try it we got some friends here they're gonna try it so when we get there when we get ready to try it we'll turn the camera back on and video that hey everybody we're here we've got the beaver cooked I got a couple taste testers I'm gonna try it along with myself Everybody, this is Amy. This is my friend Amy. This is my good friend Will. Amy's a good friend too, but she's not a Will. So, all right. So, we we cooked it just in water. I put just a few seasonings on it, and this is everybody's first time trying. So, go ahead and grab a piece. All right. Are you ready? Ready. Yeah. Cheers. Tastes like roast beef. Yeah. Tastes exactly like roast beef. Yeah. Alright. Well, kick. Nick, you want to try? It tastes like roast beef. I don't know. I'm just saying what I mean. We'll say. I'm going to try it, though. Okay. Try it. Michael. Here, give me the camera. Alright. Yeah, it tastes just like roast beef. That's amazing. It tastes good. It does. That's weird. All right. Hey, there you have it. So, eat beaver. It's good. <laughs> hey, everybody. Uh, we're back. It's uh, February 23rd. Um, we've uh, out here on my friend Tim's, uh, who's who we've been trapping beaver on. Um, it's 50 degrees today calling for a half inch of rain tomorrow on Monday and uh, I think some rain on maybe Tuesday and then turning some little bit of snow Wednesday and Thursday so now it's pretty soft out here uh, t I talked to Tim and, and we kind of decided it's getting too soft we're gonna be tearing the property up um, but Tim Tim does have an issue out here um, so we're not we've got until March 31st we're not going to give up. We've got a little over a month, so hopefully it'll dry up a little bit and the rains will hold off for a week or two and we can get back out here and uh, and, and help him out. I'm also going to do some research. I'm going to try to get educated a little more on uh, techniques, trapping beaver, um, so it, I'm more effective out here for him. Um, so we might go to the range, get some traps and stuff put away. Um, may haul the the side by side out to the shooting range get the get the uh the Bergera out maybe the uh couple other rifles i've got um 
film some of that so y'all can see how bad of a shot I truly am. Um, so we're going to do that. Um, we're getting getting close to uh, turkey season. We're going to we're going to do some filming this year. I'm, I'm almost positive that I'm going to be able to hunt all three weekends um, instead of the usual one or two that I had got to in the past. Um, so and then I think June, just to, I know I've told you this before, June we're going to Florida. Um, and then we've got uh, we got a buddy of mine up in northeast Missouri that says he's got a, a pond full of walleye and big crappie so Todd we're gonna come see you and see after that we're just gonna do probably fishing some uh, farm ponds here and there um, I talked to another guy that's got a poultry farm who we're gonna go visit him this spring um, maybe next weekend I don't know Brennan if you're available um, but what else this summer oh we got some 4-H stuff that I gonna be involved in busy with so taping will probably slack off around that time um, what else I mean it's summer's gonna be slow probably mostly fishing and just some shooting I'm gonna try to go some different places and do some shooting um, I will probably videotape I'm uh, developing a load for my uh, for my Bergera my 6.5 and just practice shooting there. I know that can get kind of boring, but we'll try to have some people come help us do that. Um, and that's that's about it. That's all I can think of now. So uh, hey, I appreciate all the nice comments and all the subs and uh, all the shares. You guys, you know, keep that going so we can keep growing and get us more opportunities. Um, and hopefully, I become a better trapper, hunter, and fisherman. All right, guys. We'll see you later. Thank you.